Well, greetings once again. This is Dr. Bill Bailey, and this is the Burt Zine Netcast. Burt Zine is the online magazine of virtualization and cloud computing. And we have some new things going on here in the studio, uh, not the least of which is my ability to go to a second camera. I can cut back and forth and have different views of the studio uh, and different shots for the camera. So, of course, I have to control it from <laughs> the computer here. So, it it causes me to pause occasionally to do certain kinds of things. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All righty. Vert Zine, of course, is a proud member of the Tech Podcast Network, techpodcast.com. If it's tech, it's right here on the Vert Zine Netcast. And we've got some things I want to share with you this week that I think will be beneficial to you if you're interested in virtualization and cloud computing. First thing I want to talk about is Cameo. I believe is the way we pronounce it. Cameo or Cameo. Um, this software is free, 100% free, even for enterprise use, even for business use. A lot of things are free for home use, but not for business use. This is free for everybody for all uses and it is very impressive software it's very much like VMware's thin app and of course uh, uh, I support VMware at uh, High Point Regional Health System where I work as well as Red Hat and Citrix and a lot of other uh, virtualized environments uh, so of course I'm always looking at these kinds of things but Cameo was very impressive and if you go to the Vertzine website v-i-r-t-z-i-n-e dot com there is a um, embedded video there that you can see how Cameo works and how it comes together and how you can use it to virtualize applications and you can actually take your applications with you on a USB stick you can put them on in the cloud the new version of Cameo actually supports Dropbox and other cloud based technologies uh, so that you can run your applications right out of the cloud very impressive stuff so I want you to check into that it's a great article and uh, really a neat uh, product so uh, particularly to be free it's just amazing to me that it's free now Amazon Cloud Search has been announced. This is a little bit of an older article because uh, we're we're doing these netcast to kind of catch up with some of the news. But this is from April the 12th of this year, eh, almost a month ago now. Uh, Amazon announced that it has a new cloud-based service, Amazon Cloud Search. It is a fully managed, highly scalable search service that businesses can easily integrate into their websites and applications to deliver a fast search experience. And, as I said, it's cloud-based. And, of course, that's what we're all about here at Vertzine is cloud computing and virtualization. Uh, speaking of that, virtualization, we have a P2V tool from Red Hat that is available for Red Hat's KVM virtualization environment. It's a new tool to do physical to virtual uh, transition, if you will, and uh, it's a great new tool that they've released, and we've got an article about that on the Vertzine uh, website as well. Uh, you can go check into that. Basically, it is a beta product, and they have released the beta for Red Hat Enterprise Linux. Uh, in version 6.3 and you can get uh, the virtualization tool vert p2v uh, which allows you to do this conversion and it's a graphical environment it's really kind of neat so check that out and I think you'll find that very beneficial very similar to the tool that we use with VMware to do p2v all right the next item we have here is VMware announces at interop that it's time to virtualize the rest of the data center. In other words, we've already virtualized the host layer, the server layer. Uh, now we're looking at virtualizing storage and networks. And specifically, they're talking about networks here. And they are moving to virtualize the rest of the data center. And as I kind of jokingly say here, if everything's virtual, where do you go to pull the plug? <laughs> but literally, that's the thing. They're virtualizing everything down, and they're virtualizing in such a way that things are not physically dependent 
which means you can replace hardware in the background without affecting your build uh, of your software, which is really pretty handy. Uh, next item we have here, and that is Citrix VDI announced at their Citrix Synergy Conference HDX system on a chip. In other words, a VDI uh, client that is entirely on a chip, like a terminal, and will tap into Citrix's uh, Zen desktop software uh, to allow a Citrix thin client basically all on a chip. So you could make those thin clients incredibly thin, very small. And uh, it's being uh, used or is going to be used by HP, by N Computing, by LG, and by Fu Fujitsu. Those are the hardware vendors that are going to incorporate this HDX on a chip into products that will be hitting the uh, supply chain pretty soon. So pretty neat announcement from Citrix. This is where we're heading, virtualization of the local desktop. And uh, we're doing, we've got a big VDI project going on at work right now. We're right in the middle of it and there's all kinds of things coming together for that. So lots of good information, lots of good things happening. Wanted to catch you up to date with all of these things. Remember until next time, keep your head in the cloud. Mm -hmm.